Today I'm going to show how I prepare some brine shrimp for my angel fry. Let's take a look. Alright, here I have this brine shrimp hatchery I got from Brine Shrimp Direct. It's really handy as it has these walls both on the bottom base and this top one where the shrimp have to swim above one below the white to get to the center where there's this sieve basket that you just harvest them out, no shells, nice and easy. So to prepare it we got water, some non-iodized salt. I use about three cups of water and one little more than one tablespoon of salt. Plop it in stir it with something until it dissolves. This hatch kit right now is on Brine Trip Direct's website for $25.95 plus shipping and they include this size 1.75 ounce of uh, eggs which itself runs I think seven or eight dollars so it's a good deal to get started it lasts quite a while I've I bought a second one and these two have lasted me probably four or five months okay I think that's pretty well dissolved. Now we just pour it in. You just want to make sure to cover the black uh, walls, but not quite over the top of the white piece so that the shrimp will go over one under the other. And then we just drop our eggs in the outer ring. I use a quarter teaspoon and use about two depending on how many angel fry I've got to deal with. One for a small batch, two if there's a little more Right now I just have the 20, well, I've got what's in the hatching or rearing jars. So I've got a bunch that should be free swimming today or tomorrow, but that's all there is to it. You got the lid, it keeps it dark, once the brine shrimp make it to the center where all the light is. You just scoop them up and they're drained and ready to feed in your tanks. Okay, it's now the next day and all the brine shrimp are here in the center. You just lift up the basket, take it on over your tank, and Rinse it out. Voila. That's all there is to harvesting the brine shrimp. So it's really easy. And like I said, it's good for you know small doses, like one tank of fry. If you get too many more go into like a two liter bottle or one of the bigger setups would be good but this is nice and easy for raisin fry or at least these angel fry the first month or so now they're these ones are to the point that they need a lot more uh, if I were to feed them only brine shrimp they'd be eaten faster than that thing could hatch them so that's it about this uh, brine shrimp hatchery from Brine Shrimp Direct. Bye.